Hey, this is David Abdo for PremierGuitar.com. In this video, we're going to be checking out a new bass from Paul Reed Smith. This is the Granger 5. As you can see, it has a very beautiful flame maple top. This is uh, one of the 10 tops. It's an upgrade. Uh, but this is capping a mahogany body. The neck is constructed of quarter-sawn maple. It's topped with a rosewood fretboard. If you want, you can get it in a maple fretboard as well, if you prefer something a little brighter. It has the beautiful bird inlays that Paul Reed Smith is known for. The electronics are uh, Gary Granger signature pickups, uh, the dual blade configuration. It's kind of cool. The preamp is a new design for Paul Reed Smith. Uh, you have volume for the neck, volume for the bridge, bass, mid, and treble EQ. But there's a little extra twist to this configuration. Uh, the volume knobs are push-pull pots. And when you pull up on one of the pots, it solos that particular pickup disengages the other pickup and sets it into passive mode. For example, by pulling up on the neck pickup, we have our neck pickup soloed, the bridge pickup is out, and it's in passive mode. Pulling up on the bridge volume, engages the bridge pickup, disables the neck pickup, and sets it into passive mode. If you want fully passive mode, pull up on both pickups. Pressing down brings it back to the uh, active mode, which is an 18 volt preamp. And uh, that's basically a little tour of the electronics on the body. To give you a little taste of the Granger 5, I'm gonna play a couple samples for you. Uh, the EQ is going to be flat. The volume and the bridge volume are going to be turned up all the way. And the Granger 5 is gonna be being played through an Ashdown uh, Mi Bass 2.0 amp with the Mi 12 cabinet. <laughs> To show you how the passive mode works, I'm going to start by popping the neck pickup up. The EQ is obviously disabled. And I'll play a little bit of a riff and then bring that down and pull up on the bridge volume knob. <laughs> To show you how the passive mode works in the Granger 5, I'm going to pop the neck pickup, play a little bass line, and then in between, bring that down and pop up the bridge pickup. You can see how easy it is to switch between these two pickups with this configuration. <laughs> To give you a taste of what the Granger 5 sounds like, I'm going to play a real simple walking line. The volume knobs are both turned up all the way. The EQ is set flat. And here's what it sounds like. Here's a little taste of slapping on the Granger 5. I uh, boosted the bass just a little bit and both pickups are all the way up. I'm going to turn up the bass just a little bit and this is what the Granger 5 sounds like with your thumb and finger.
One of the most important aspects of a five string is having a really solid B string. And the Granger five has a really nice focused uh, low B. I'm going to play the open B string and then the first four frets just to let you hear the note definition on the Granger. Lots of definition, lots of clarity, really nice five. To check out the review of the Paul Reed Smith Granger 5, go to premierguitar.com. If you'd like to see more reviews or any rig rundowns, subscribe to our YouTube channel and you can see a lot more cool videos like this one.